And we have new details tonight about the crash over the weekend that killed five teens near the Arapaho Elbert County line. And while we knew most of their names, today the coroner named them all. They ranged in age from 15 to 19 years old, all kids. All died from injuries in that crash. And near the spot of that crash is one of the most famous, thought to be paranormal spots in Colorado. And lately, more and more Colorado teenagers are showing up at the so called ghost bridge. Yeah, these stories almost give you chills. Denver 7's Mark Boyle looks into claims that this bridge is actually haunted. And the legend of Ghost Bridge dates back to the late 1800s. But even as late as last night, teens are coming here in droves looking for paranormal activity. Those living around here, though, say their presence is adding its own element of danger. It's on the Arapaho Elbert County line in the middle of nowhere. But Ghost Bridge, otherwise known as Third Bridge, is said to be haunted. And teens like Kelsey Stobel know about it too. It's creepy, and I shouldn't go out there, but we did because it was haunted, I guess. And the legend is long as the horizon is distant, a site of a Native American massacre. The murder of a nearby family in the late 1800s and several fatal car crashes involving teens. The latest just last week. Yeah, I won't go out there anymore just because of that. Joe Carter lives here and says the lore doesn't end there. We had a murder right there, right at the top of the hill. That was a school teacher. He was murdered right there, so then that's in that timeline. But the landowner here says he fears with all the teens gathering on the bridge at night. One may get hit by a car. Carter says he's seen them too. Oh, there was probably 15, probably. And as soon as we rode up on Harley's, <laughs> it scared the hell out of them. <laughs> as for adding to the legend, many of the tragedies that have happened here are widely reported and well known. And the belief in ghosts and other paranormal activities, we'll leave that up to you. Do you believe in ghosts like that? Not really. <laughs> no. No, but the story's cool. Reporting in eastern Arapahoe County, Mark Boyle, Denver 7. And the landowner's asking people not to visit at night. He says he regularly chases off kids who are out there shooting off fireworks, even firing guns.